Hey YouTube creators, this is Francie with Created by Francie. So I wanted to show you some things I'm working on. I finished this week and what I'm working on today. I think I'm gonna just do like a continual blog as I work on it. We'll see how that works. But um, so one evening this week, I made this sea turtle. And I love the eyes, the glitter eyes. It's wonderful. So this is from the Timu the brown or tan, whatever you want to call it. And then the top is a burnet blanket and it's just, it's really soft. I like it though. I wouldn't want to do a whole animal with that. Um, I've learned solid colors always work so much better. So, um, but for the top of the turtle, I think it looks good. And then I also went ahead and made a whale with that. And, you know, I try to give it some color because if I use just black, it's hard to see the eyes. But this is a little whale. This guy is from Club Crochet, and I have a membership with his website so I can get all his patterns. And he does really great videos too, especially for beginners, it's worked. I have to fast forward through a lot, um, but or I, I sometimes just look at the pattern. Um, I'm still not very good at these fins and stuff, but it's cute, I like it. Um, then I made another chicken, a white one. It's not completely finished. I got to add the, you know, the top, <laughs> but, um, so that's what I, this week got done, which is usually, it's more than usual. Usually I just can, um, crochet on Saturdays. So, um, and Sundays. So that's nice that during the week I was able to get something done. So some things that have happened with me. It seems like there is a lot of market day videos. This is what I did at the market. I'm getting ready for market. Everything is market, market, market. And I'm like, okay, I'm not going to market, but you know, I still like to talk about crocheting and creating. And so um, I, I do have an opportunity. There is a shop that's opening up and I live near an island called Anna Maria Island. You can look it up. It's a tourist trap island but um somebody is opening a shop and she wanted artists to put stuff in her shop and sell it on consignment and so i thought well it's probably a long shot because i'm not really an artist per se um i create i i i, I call myself more of a creator um so i sent her pictures of it and at first i don't think she was going to um have me participate and so um, I just kind of bugged her one more time because she said she had sent out the emails to the vent to vendors. And I thought, well, I didn't get an email. So, and then I sent her some more pictures um, of like the cute marine animals because it is on an island, right? And then she sent me a contract. So the contract is like initially for five, 90 days, you put your stuff in her shop. And it's a 60-40 split, so she gets 40%, which is steep. Um, so, you know, you have to think about that. So I have to price my items far enough above what I normally would price them to get what I want. So I figured I'm going to try it for 90 days and see what happens. If anything, maybe we'll get my name out there and I've got to create business cards now and um, maybe I can get orders that way. Um, it's networking is what it is. So, um, anyway, that means I got to get a lot of sea turtles made, um, because I think these will be popular. I've bought a manatee pattern. And so I bought two manatee patterns. Um, one's really big though. Um, but I'm going to try it and see what happens. So, and then, so what I'm working on today, I want to try to focus is this guy right here. So this is a pattern from All From Jade, and I have the big um, pattern of this, but she's changed it a little bit. So um, I, I bought this one. This is a mini one, and so I'm making that today. Um, and so I've got, there's the little tentacles. Sorry, I dropped one. Four tentacles so far, I need eight. This one is really short because I cut it before I did the three stitches on top and I was just like, oh, please have enough. But I've got four made. And so this is what I want to kind of journey. 
as I get this created today, I'll do little snaps and show you how I progress. Um, can't ever do a tutorial of somebody else's pattern, of course. So I'm just going to give you clips of how I finish it out. Another thing that's going on is our school is having an auction fundraiser thing next Saturday. And so the fundraiser person came and I was talking to her. I said, let me show you something because I had a whole bag of my stuffed animals. I said, um, I thought about crocheting a panther. Remember my panther? I told her about the panther I'm creating and because we're panthers. And she said, oh, that would be really great to put in the auction. So she said, she's trying to encourage me to finish it, but I'm hesitant with the head. I just don't know that it will look like a panther head, but I need to try and finish that um, today or tomorrow. And then I thought one reason I'm making this octopus, because I think this would be good at an auction too, with the little baby octopuses in the bottom. Um, and then maybe I could even make a dad and have the whole family. So I don't know. We'll see. I want to at least get the mom done. And so, so far, four tentacles. So let's get going. Okay. I've got eight tentacles. At first I thought I was making the mom, but I think this is going to be the dad. This is going to be the color for the dad. And I was looking at two colors for the mom. I have this pink, but I think this is Burnett yarn. And then I have this color, which is like a, I don't know, a light peach pink. I don't know. Um, this is Sweet Snuggles Light, which is what I'm making the dad with. So I think I'm going to go ahead and make it with this, make the mom with this. And then the babies, I could make one of each color for the babies. This is so soft though. I might do another one and do a dad, you know, in the same color and then the mom in the pink. Um, because with this new store, I need to make as many as I can. So I have all the tentacles done. So at this point, I move on to the body of the dad. And with the dad, we're just going to stuff and add the tentacles. So I may be done, I don't know, maybe within an hour. I hope so. Then I got to pick the eyes. We got to pick out some neat eyes for that. And then I will start with the mom. Same thing. You just do the eight tentacles first and then move on to the body. So let's get working on the body. Okay, moving right along. I almost got the head down. I need to snap the eyes on. You're supposed to put them between rounds 11 and 12. So you've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. And that is that, or am I run one? It might be one row down. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Okay, this is eleven. That's eleven, and that's twelve. So with five stitches that you can see, one, two, three, four, and five. So um, what I need to do is snap these things on and these are not easy to put on. I say that watches. So it just went on just a little bit. And what I do is I use this tool and I'll set it on there and I'll push down with all my strength <laughs> to get it to snap. So once we get the eyes snapped, then I will close this. I'll attach the, the tentacles, then you close it up and the dad will be done. So then I will need to make the mom. So progressing along, here we are. All legs, tentacles, tentacles are attached. And so at this point I need to stuff and so that closed and uh, yeah, trust the process that this is going to look like a circle. <laughs> so I'm going to stuff it and close it up and then I'll show you the end product. Okay. So the dad is done. I don't know if I'm going to put a little smile on him. I don't know. So I think the yarn I used is a little bit smaller than the one that is shown in the picture, but he's cute. He's cute, cute, cute. It'll be cute when I get the whole family done. That's going to be neat. So just to show you the pattern again, 
right there, all from Jade. So now I work on the mom. All right, it is almost midnight Saturday and I finally got the whole family done. So we have the dad and he's stuffed pretty good because I can fill the bottom, you know, and stuff him. So he's pretty firm, solid. I haven't decided to give him a smile yet. I haven't decided that. So I got the dad and then I finished the mom. So here's the mom. Let's show them together. Me and the dad. <laughs> the mom's eyes look further apart, but I don't know, may not be the exact same yarn. You know, it's just, it's just funny. And then, in the bottom, is where you put the babies. And they're tucked in, they're pretty tight. So here's one baby. And you can fit two babies in there. Two babies. So there's the bottom. And we've got two babies. Oh, there's my cat. The two babies. And let's see if I can hold the dad. There we go. The octopus family. What do you think? Took me all day, but again, I do get distracted um, and I do other things in between but for I did sit and crochet a lot though but and then you can just take these and put them back in there and um, yeah so they're not the easiest things to get in probably after you do it for a while something's weird about my camera okay so there we go and they're in. So if I put the same color one, you can't tell. Anyway, I'm going to end this video with that. Um, hopefully you enjoyed seeing that today. Um, I will keep you posted about this store that I'm supposed to be putting stuff into. And otherwise, I'll just keep crocheting when I can. Um, see you in the next video. And y'all give joy to others.